Hello guys and happy Motivation Monday. Thank you for coming back. So today's message is all for, um, it's about motivation. So the word is find what drives you, find what motivates you. So the reason that you're here at my channel and the reason that you know I even exist in this world is because you wanted to find a way to feel motivated, to feel inspired in order to better yourself. And I truly appreciate that. And I appreciate you being here and looking to me for that. Um, but the main part about life is to find what works best for you. Now, if everyone were to be born and simply do what everyone did before them, then how boring would that be? Why would you ever want to take the same exact path as every single body else? Why? So looking at it from a fitness standpoint, you learn as a child, actually, what you need to do in order to be successful in being healthy in life. However, a lot of people tend to overlook these, um, these reasonings, these practices, all of this because it's either too hard or it's just not desirable, it doesn't sound good, it's too much of a routine, and it's just too much of something, okay? And the main part about life and the main part about fitness is finding balance. So balance is having one cheat meal a week while... Um, staying towards your path, towards your goal of healthy foods for the other parts of the week. Some people find that to be just way, way, way too much for them and they would rather have a cheat meal every single day because what is life if you can't eat what you want, okay? So you can eat what you want, go ahead, eat what you want every single day, but you will never, ever reach the goals that you want aesthetically inside, mentally, and everything. You will gain weight. I mean, that's just the way it is. So you have to decide whether you want to just eat, 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 eat all the time, or whether you want to find balance. And truly, truly, once you sit down and choose between those two paths, that is where you will hit a point in your life where you decide that you actually do want to better yourself. Considering you choose the right path, balance. You don't want to, There's there are two sides. You don't need to be an extreme dieter and you don't need to be an extreme non-dieter. There is something in the middle for everyone. And that's where the word comes into play. What are you going to find in the middle? And so you watch videos, you see people on, you, on YouTube, on Instagram, on Twitter, on Facebook. What do they do to look like that? I wanna look like that. How can I look like that? You have to find what works for you. You have to find what motivates you because what I did to get to where I am is going to be totally different than what you do to get to where you are going to be. You can follow me, but I would encourage you to do every everything on in your own way. For instance, if I were to share my macros with you, those aren't your macros. You don't follow those macros. Those macros are based on my weight, my height, my activity, my age, my body makeup, my genetic makeup, my just genetics in general. I put on muscle easily and I uh, take a long time to burn fat. So therefore I do more cardio and little, not as much heavy lifting anymore. Whereas you say you um, lose fat easily, but you don't put on muscle easily, but you're still lifting light and still doing cardio. You're not gonna look like me by doing what I do because your genetic makeup is totally different. So the basis of what I'm trying to get around is find your own path, find your own journey. Do what works for you and you will not know what works for you unless you try a bunch of different ways and a good a good standpoint is if you were say you tried low carb dieting for i would i would give it a couple months okay by the end of a couple months if you have not had significant changes then you need to move on to your next 
thing. Maybe try macro tracking. If you've done clean eating and you haven't got results, try macro tracking, try carb cycling, try intermittent fasting, try it all, do it yourself, but do not go to one human being in this planet and follow step by step what they are doing because that is not you, it's not for you, it's tailored to that person, not you. So don't blindly follow the people in the world, don't blindly follow me, don't blindly follow. Be your own leader. Find your own motivation. Do you, okay? <laughs> Do what makes you happy, what motivates you, and everything in between. Because at the end of the day, this is for you. Who is it for? Not for me. It's not for the person next to you. It's for you. So do it for you all day, every single day, and never, ever, ever forget why you started. Don't. Don't. The second you feel down, come back to this video, come back to all my other Motivation Monday videos, and just, just remember, don't copy people. Don't copy their diet, copy their training, anything. Switch it up, do you, okay? That's the word for the day. So thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you for coming back to me. You rock. If you like this, subscribe. If you think that somebody needs to hear this message today, Share it. Share it with your people. Blog about it. Do whatever. I don't care. Uh, but do give it a thumbs up because it really helps me and it helps motivate me to do more. So I'll be back next Monday with another wonderful word for you all. And thank you again for watching.